Hey guys, today I'm going to show you a benchmark of Grid 2 running on my 15 inch MacBook Pro with Retina display. I'm using a 1080p external display with VSync off and 8x AA. We're going to start out by choosing the automatic preset, which on this machine becomes the medium preset. Just so you guys know, I'm not the one driving. There's actually a graphics benchmark option in the menu, which just sets up the same track and car and has the game race itself. The race runs about two minutes, and I did a second run for each setting without Fraps recording to get accurate results because the Fraps recording takes about five to ten frames away. As you can see on the automatic medium preset, we're averaging about 47 frames per second, which is definitely playable. Next we're going to try the high preset. Okay, so on high we're averaging about 36 frames, it's about 10 less than on medium, and it's still playable, but I would probably stick to medium because it doesn't look that much different. Okay, now we're going to try the ultra preset. I'm sure you noticed that I'm just showing you the first 20 seconds of the race at each setting for fair and consistent results. Okay, so on Ultra we're averaging 20 frames, which is probably too low to enjoy, but the game does look spectacular. I would probably stay away from Ultra. Next, we're going to run the low preset. Alright, on the low preset we get a max of 118 with an average of 54 frames, so the game runs very smooth on low at the cost of some of the nice graphic elements. And lastly we're going to run in the ultra low preset. Okay, so on ultra low, somehow the maximum frame rate was less than on low, but it doesn't really matter too much. We're averaging almost 63 frames per second, which is very good, but the game certainly looks like it's from the last generation without all of the complex textures. So, I like to play in the automatic medium preset because the game runs pretty smooth while looking nice, and that's all I can really ask for out of this laptop. If you're really anal about getting that stable 60 frames, you'll have to either run it on low or ultra low, or try lowering the resolution, which I didn't do in this video because most people play at 1080p. I hope you enjoyed this commentary and thanks for watching.